Um, I'm Wendy and I'm playing Anne Boleyn in Ladies in Waiting and I am presenting this drug history on behalf of Andrea Carmichael who donated to get our show to the fringe. Woo! So I am going to tell the story of the Alan Burr and Alexander Hamilton duo. Um, okay, so you have to look at this, you guys. <laughs> There's Alexander Hamilton, Solomon Immigrant, and Alan Burr, who was a guy. <laughs> Did they get along? No. No. They were like whatevs about each other. Because, mm -hmm. like. Because <laughs> apparently, Burr was like, don't tell people your opinion on anything. And Hamilton was like, I believe in this. I believe in that. <laughs> um, and he liked to write a lot. Like, he wrote all these. Essays? Like 54 essays? <laughs> Who has time for that? Anyway, so he's doing that and stuff. Um, and Alan Burr was like, I'm oh, gonna be a lawyer. So anyway, so what happened was these guys like kept like crossing paths. Oh my god. The big thing was that Burr was running for president. And so was Thomas Jefferson. I wrote a report on him in fifth grade. I thought he was cool. Turns out, not so much. Um, and what happened was, it boiled down to who Hamilton gave the endorsement to. And Hamilton was like, well, Burr doesn't really like commit to anything. And so he was like, Jefferson. He commits to shit, you know? He's not a commitment foe. And so he was like, I'm gonna give my endorsement to Jefferson. And Jefferson was like, whoop whoop! And so Jefferson won the presidency. So Burr, Burr, Burr is vice president. And stuff. Uh, but there was this other guy. I think his name was Charles something. And Charles was like, hey, Burr, Hamilton was talking some smack about you um, this one time. And so Burr was like, Hamilton, what's up with that? And Hamilton was like, I don't know what you're talking about. And Burr was like, well, this guy, Charles, said you were talking some smack about me. And Hamilton was like, oh, I don't know. I mean, maybe I said something this one time at like a dinner party, but it was so long ago, I don't remember. And Burr was like, that's fucked up, you were talking smack, what else? Uh, and so, they were like, let's do it! And then, what they did was they went, sailed from New York to New Jersey. Contrary to musical, Hamilton. Alexander Hamilton! Doing not legal in New Jersey, they were just a little less, you know, they didn't persecute it, or no, enforce it. They didn't enforce it so much. So anyway, so like, let's go to New Jersey, like, all right, fine, whatever. So they go there, they go to New Jersey, sailing across the river, and they get there, and they have their buddies, the people who they brought with them, to turn around because that way they could deny accountability. Okay. 
community. And um, so what happened was, all they know is that they heard two shots. Not gonna waste my shot. Um, but it turns out, one of the shots, Hamilton's, was found in a tree. So that was located behind where Burr was standing. But what happened was, Hamilton got shot. And as soon as he got shot, you know, bang, bang, people turn around, what? Hamilton on the ground. Burr's like, what? Okay, let's get Burr out of here. And they sailed back to the river. And Hamilton was like, ah, oh, I got shot in my bullet ricochet off my rib into a liver or something. And then he's like, I'm going to die. And so. He died. But what that did was it actually ended up ruining Burr's career for the rest of his life. He failed miserably, blah, 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 off into oblivion. Tried to be a lawyer again, didn't pan out. I think he went to France, didn't pan out. Anyway, blah, 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 miserable life after that. Bang, bang, gun. Uh, Hamilton, no, Hamilton dead. Burr, life ruined. Yeah, I think you got it. I think that's it. Mm -hmm. Is that it? Yeah. Is, is that enough? Yeah, anything else you want to say? Throwing away my shot. I am not throwing away my shot. I am Alexander Hamilton. Hamilton, just you wait. I am not throwing away my shot. No, not, it's not musically important.